Welcome back to Killsby Lane for what will be our return to training. Uh, this is the procedure, what is in place for when players and coaches arrive for training on the allocated days. Come down the main driveway, you will get your parents, players and coaches will pull into car park three. This will be the drop off area. The coaches will park their vehicles to the rear of the car park. And they can leave their vehicles there then to unload all their equipment, get it down to the pitch. Coaches are allowed to arrive 15 minutes prior to training in order to get all their equipment out and make their way down towards the pitch. Parents and players can only arrive five minutes prior to training start. They need to wait in their vehicles until the coach instructs them to come over and invites them onto the pitch after using a hand sanitising station. As they come out of their vehicles, again adhering to the two metre social distancing rule, the facility I've put in place the two metre guidelines all the way down the pathway leading up into the main entrance to the turnstile which is the only way into training. As you come down the pathway as you'll see on the wall there next to the tea bar and the welfare poster is where the hand sanitising station will be. All players must use the hand sanitising station before they can enter the pitch. Parents are allowed to watch all of the training session but that will be behind the main stand and will be on the bank area there of the grass where they can stand and watch the training. Please bear in mind though that if any players do need the toilet while the training session is going on the parents must meet them to round up the toilets as a safeguarding measure. Once the parents have dropped off the players They'll need to move the vehicles round to car parks one and two. Car park one being here closest to us now to the building. They simply need to park the cars in them spaces and then they can move around to watch the players should they want to. If not, they need to wait in their vehicles. Prior to training finishing, they need to come back to their vehicles and wait in the vehicles only. We do not want any parents around at the exit. Again, as you can see, Social distancing markers are in place all the way around the building. Try and get our players and parents to adhere to them at all times. And we're moving around now to the exit where all the players, coaches will leave. Players and coaches are to leave at the same time. Any balls or equipment is to be cleaned when you get home to make sure that we're off the pitch and we allow the next set of teams to come on. Okay, so at the moment, I know there's some vehicles here. They won't be obviously on the day, but we have the main exit here now for the pitch. Again, leading out there, you need to come to the left, use a hand sanitizing station there again, prior to leaving the facility. And again, the social distancing markers here in place. Over here is where the main toilets will be. And again, next to the sign, another hand sanitizing station will be there. Also inside, there will also be a table with hand sanitizing uh, pumps and things like that there as well. One in, one out scenario into the toilets, just so we can adhere to the social distancing measures. Again, we're asking parents and players, any surfaces that you touch or handle, can you please clean them after you? dispose of any rubbish either in the toilets or the bins provided. Thank you.